know you dropped a bomb on me. It's amazing. What's up now, Torino? This history, it's all lies. It says Hitler killed himself, and then we nuked Japan. And people believe this shit. <laughs> Jesus. Well, it'll make them sleep better at night, I guess. Hey, man, what did you want? Is you gonna free my brother? No, not now. And here's a little news flash. I said that to get you to do something for me. Man, you real fucked up. But the shocker is, we are gonna look after him. Because I need him alive as much as you do. Oh, thanks. You know, after what you've done for me, you know, it's like you're a pro now. I got double agents in Panama. I want to put a price on your head. A Russian spy. Little fat Boris-looking guy. He's asking for clearance to interrogate you. Russian style. Calipers on the genitals. Feels good. You'd like it. That ain't nothing cool, man. Just leave me alone. You bad news. Don't worry about it. The Russians got bigger things to worry about than your genitals, believe me. The whole country went to shit. You know, we tried hard to put a lid on it, but that idiot Gorbachev with his little strawberry in his forehead, he gave away the crown jewels. Still, they got their, you know, their boy in the White House. That was nice. So? What you want me to do? Now listen, I need you to buy me some property, okay? Shouldn't cost that much. You offer them a dollar. If they give you a hard time, kill them. I'm gonna need you to start doing some real wet work here for me soon, okay? Enough of this little girl bullshit. Now get out of here. Come on, beat it. The 80s, line 18. Hello. Okay, man. I warned you. I've been over to the other side. What are you talking about, buddy? I've been inside. Inside everything. Seen everything. Remember the first time you did mushrooms? There are aliens living in the state. Aliens. And I've held them in my own hands. Everybody, go to the desert. Beg their forgiveness. How do you know all this? I went to the camp. Believe what you want to believe, but ask yourself, why should I make this up? The only thing I want to ask myself is how I can keep you off future shows. Oh, God. Uh, Kevin, hello. You're on the air. All the missiles are under my control, not the government's control. Why do you think they put me in solitary confinement for eight months? Because I can launch nuclear missiles by just whistling into a phone. Really? Great. Could you wipe out all the other radio stations in town for me? Hey, I don't do that anymore. I only use my powers for good. Ah, look. This isn't a cartoon or TV show. Let's get real for a second. The problem with people like you who have superpowers is that you really don't use them for good. If I had superpowers, everyone would be naked. And women signing autographs at conventions couldn't resist me. All right, going to the conspiracy line. Yeah, this is Montag. Okay. My name's Montag. Oh, yes, yes, I got that. Hey, have you ever leveled a house with a helicopter? Uh, no, but... That'd be really cool. I thought you were a DJ. You used to talk more about killing people with helicopters. I prefer electric cables. Hey, Jethro, how is it? Yo, dude, the garage is coming along nicely, man. But I rang about something else. There's an unofficial street racing club in San Fierro. Unofficial as in illegal, right? I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Anywho, they meet up around the driving school someplace. Thought you might, you know, like to know. Thanks, Jethro. I'm gonna think about it, and I'll holler at you. Later, man. Hey, don't sweat it. So is the brain. Uh, you talk too that. much. Well, if you look out the window, <laughs> you will notice your car is on fire. Oh my god! Fernando is back.
So what do you think of our new base of operations? It's missing something. Maybe a tennis court and a pool will help motivate me better. Very nice call, very cute. Uh, so listen, now, <clears throat> you're gonna have to learn how to fly. No, I ain't. Yes, actually you are. I set out a series of tests for you. You can access them on that TV. You're gonna have to prove to me that you can fly if you're gonna continue working towards your brother's freedom. Shit, whatever, man. Very nice.